Hello everyone, this is Tim, and I have a really, really fun video for you today because we're gonna be demonstrating NDI Embedded Bridge. Now, Embedded Bridge is new with NDI 6. Those familiar with NDI will be familiar with NDI Bridge, and you'll know that it runs on PCs running NDI Bridge software. The host location running in host mode and the remote locations running in join mode. Now, with the introduction of NDI 6 and Embedded Bridge, this means that the NDI device itself is capable of sending video, audio, and metadata to the location in host mode. Now, Bolin is a leader in NDI 6, and in particular with Embedded Bridge. Our entire outdoor line of PTZ cameras supports Embedded Bridge. Our EG40N high bandwidth NHX3 decoder supports Embedded Bridge, as does our R9 series flagship indoor PTZ cameras. Now, my colleague Sapan is at a park not too far from our office, and I'm going to toss it over to him. Sapan, tell us what's going on and how this signal flow works. Hey everyone, Sapan here, product manager at Bolin Technology, and I'm coming to you live from a park that's not too far from an our office, but the best part is it's all happening through the embedded bridge in Bolin's cameras. So let's walk you through what that setup is. As you see in the frame, we have an EX Ultra 420N in this case, that's on a set of tripod. We have power coming in from a battery that's just a little bit, a little bit further away. We have audio coming in from my Sennheiser wireless pack going into our audio connector. And then we have a single network cable that is providing us network from our Magiwell cellular bonded box. That's right down here. So we have a mobile SIM card in here and then the network cable just goes right back to the camera. Now on the camera side, all I did is log into the web interface and enter the NDI bridge details that Tim provided me for our studio. And I did that while I was still in the office. So when I came out to the park, all I had to do was power everything on and embedded bridge immediately turns on and it's transmitting right back to that TriCaster. And that's the power of NDI embedded bridge. Now remember, NDI bridge is a two-way connection. It's not just a singular direction. What that means is in addition to me sending my NDI feed from this camera here, if I had other NDI devices on this network, they would all be sent over to the studio using that one embedded bridge connection. But also what that means is whatever is happening in the studio and whatever NDI devices are connected on that network, I'm able to receive them from here as well. So if I wanted to get real-time feedback as a confidence monitor, I could just decode that feed using a decoder, that, a decoder or a computer or even an iPad that's running an NDI studio monitor application on it. As long as it can receive an NDI feed, it'll act as if it's on the same network. So this is the power of using embedded bridge built into Boland's devices. Back to you, Tim. Well, thank you, Sapan. As you could see and hear, our EX Ultra running embedded bridge in that remote location was sending video and audio to us here in the studio. And as a reminder, as long as one device is running embedded bridge, then any of the NDI devices in our studio can receive the video and the audio, and importantly, the video and audio from our host location is available to that remote location. Now, not every device supports embedded bridge. Bolin is a leader in this technology, and we are excited to see how you take advantage of embedded bridge in our products. Please let us know in the comments below to learn more about NDI, NDI Embedded Bridge, and all of Bolin's products. Please visit bolintechnology.com. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.